Step 1. Get one piece of 4 foot by 4 foot insulated sheathing. Using a tape measure or any other straight edge, find the center of the square. Step 2. After finding the center, use a string to get a circle on the insulated sheathing. Step 3. After the circle has been made, use a saw to cut out the circle to the best of your ability. We are using insulated sheathing rather than plywood. It is lighter, cheaper, and easier to work with. Step 4. Clean up the mess so that you have a clean space to work in. Step 5. Trace the circle onto a second 4 foot by 4 foot insulated sheathing. After you traced it, cut out the second circle. Step 6. Get at least a 4 mm thick plastic sheet and spread it out on the ground. Step 7. Put one of the insulated sheathing circles onto the plastic sheet and using a ruler, mark around it about 10 inches. It does not have to be perfect. Step 8. Cut out a circle using the marks as a guide, and once again, it does not have to be perfect. Step 9. Using part of a leaf blower, trace out the circle so that you can cut it out. Then cut out a hole in both of the insulated sheathings. We are using two sheets to keep it sturdy and stable. Step 10. Fold over the plastic on the insulated sheathing and secure it down with duct tape. Try to keep the folds uniform and remember, there is never enough duct tape. <laughs> make sure to use a lot of duct tape. You want to make it as airtight as physically possible. Step 11. Using a foam or all-purpose adhesive, put a layer of adhesive on the insulated sheathing that you just put duct tape onto. Step 12. Place the other insulated sheath on top of the other one so the holes align and put something heavy on top of it to keep it glued securely while it dries. Step 13. Using a drill, Drill a hole in the hovercraft through the plastic. The bit of the drill will depend on the size of the bolt that you have bought. Step 14. Put the bolt through the top of the hovercraft and put it through a pre-drilled plastic lid. Using a nut, tighten it down. Step 15. Cut holes in the middle of the circle around the plastic lid. Then do a few puncture holes on the outside. Step 16. Test out the hovercraft with the leaf blower. If it doesn't work, you may have messed up along the building process. You put too much weight on it, or you need a better leaf blower. 